Hi, he blew out a wheel. Crap. Stay with me, buddy. Man. How did she not get hit? Bender's gone. Smoking. Ooh, bikes are trashed. Oh my gosh. All right, you guys, here's just a quick update. Um, we were driving the very final two hour stretch from my mom's house in Fenton, Michigan. We were heading out to Grand Haven to camp until we could take ownership of our house. And um, when we hit I-69, we were on it for a little bit, a couple of miles. It was really bumpy. I'd just been on the phone with my wife because she said it looked like I was going to shake everything off the trailer because it's bouncing so much. They'd cut so many strips of new or patch the road so much with new little pieces that it was just making like this wave. And so I was watching in my rear view and I was keeping a good eye on the trailer. Uh, and in doing so, I saw my wife spin out at least two times around I saw. I don't know how many more she'd had. I thought she'd been hit. Somebody, you know, took her out. Maybe, maybe she blew out a tire. I don't know, but I thought she'd been in an accident. I told my son and we tried to get off the shoulder as quickly as we could. But there was a guardrail, and with that big rig, I needed to get it over. So we were down the way, down the road a ways, had to run up. And as we were coming, that's when I filmed that first part you just saw. Uh, but I wanted to stop the camera, see how she was doing, talk to the guys that were there, um, other people that had just missed her, almost hit her. She didn't get hit at all. Did not hit any of the guardrails, which is great. Didn't flip it, which is amazing having that, um, which you'll see here in a minute is she didn't get a blowout. The whole wheel assembly basically came off, snapped the axle, gone, um, destroyed the bikes, but uh, we'll let that roll. Wow, we are very, very lucky. Thank God. Destroyed bikes. Ripped off the fender here. Axle came clear out. Blew that whole back end apart. <coughs> wow. Alright, so when the crash happened, the bike rack and everything crashed to the road because it all dropped down, hit this and broke the frame on this trick. Axles snapped off inside. Alright, so after all of that, we had it towed to Owasso and then um, called up Geico, but um, you know, it's just hard to get through to anything right now. COVID, it's just, you know, everybody has a shortened or smaller workforce. So, um, we finally got a call from them the next day, had it towed to, um, Unlimited Off-Road in Fenton, Michigan, and, uh, they're looking at it for us. So we went on to Grand Haven, got into the outdoor adventures there. We're members of that. So we can camp pretty much in several nine, maybe nine campgrounds or so across Michigan and two in Ohio, I think. So we just were camping out there until we could uh, close on the house. And um, we decided that night we needed something different. So my brother was gracious. He and his wife happened to be at my mom's and um, they grabbed our minivan, brought it to us at the tow truck place. And we went on, we continued on, camped. And then we went down to Grand Haven for um, just so the kids could see Lake Michigan for the first time, catch the sunset, and then see the musical fountains that are there. Every night they play a themed, or not a themed, but I guess, I guess it's themed. Anyway, they, they have these fountains across the water that just are timed and they, you know, do awesome light show with music and they're timed and syncopated. Very, very cool. Very cool downtown. We'll be going there a lot. Um, but anyway... That's kind of the update. We kind of had a peaceful end of the night after the chaos. I just got the kids not thinking about it because um, Dominic was pretty shaken about the spin out and all that. So anyway, we feel very blessed. Um, 
that the Lord protected them in that accident or non-accident. The police didn't know what to even call it. So, um, but now we just wait to find out from Unlimited Off-Road what the damage is going to be uh, with that whole rear assembly. Looked like the axle has to be completely replaced to me. I don't know what other damage was done in that spin out. Um, so we'll wait to see. Anyway, guys, thanks for tuning in. More coming on the move. It's going to be awesome. Stick with it, guys. We'll see you soon.